Yo, back for part three of High on Life. Now, it's last time I played this was a year ago, July 2023, which is a long time between like sessions of playing a game, isn't it, really? But it is what it is. Let's jump in. It's coming off Game Pass, of course, so hence the uh, prioritisation on the games to play. I, I think I'm going to get trapped into this thing, though, of only ever playing games that are coming off Game Pass or due for like delisting do you know what i mean if i if I, if i played games prioritized completing games that are coming off game pass or being delisted i would never play any other type of game though that's the trouble so like of the five that are coming off in a week's time i've just chosen two that need to get my attention really Partly because the price is to buy, really. I mean, this high on life. Although I'm going to buy it. When I buy it, I'll buy the DLC. But I'll wait a, w a bit because they're always pricey whilst just coming off Game Pass or having just come off Game Pass. Um, yeah, that high on knife thing. It's about two and a half hours completion time. Okay, last time we did the Kruger's bounty, 12 months ago. <laughs> Uh, I got a new bounty coming up, so hey, see what that's uh, like. just so you know, you can use the Bounty 5000 to revisit any planet you've been before. There's portal doors all over. You can just uh, use them whenever and grind for money, look for loot you missed, whatever. Up to you. Just thought I'd tell you. I think... You better watch your step, kid. I didn't give you all this swag for free. Shock you really bad. If you need to shock somebody or shock anyone else or shock yourself, if that's the thing, you you, you gotta just <laughs> come to us and like, oh god damn, oh fuck, oh, oh I'm gonna fuck. Okay, all right, so uh, uh, just go to us and we'll we'll go fill your shock rod needs. Oh, okay. Just, got that, just, just that morty sense of humor, w isn't w it? Good luck out there. I'm gonna go explore Blim while you're out there bounty hunting. Hey, be careful out there. Humans are a valuable commodity. Someone might try to snatch you up. I can take care of myself, Gene. So weird. It's such a good game. So, uh, what kind of stuff did you do in here? Like anything gross? <laughs> you have to tell me. Like seriously, come on. We're best friends now. <laughs> A lot of detail, isn't there? A lot of detail. But don't go hiding under those blankets, or you'll miss today's chilling movie, Tammy and the T-Rex. We may not understand much about humans and their creepy lifestyles. Did you know that they worship their moms and dads and school principals? But apparently this dinosaur-centric thrill ride was one of the most famous movies of all time on Earth. Grab the blob corn and settle in for the fright of your life. Okay, let's go Here, for Douglas. Tammy and the T-Rex. Only on human TV. Been a while since I've remembered those controls. I could actually just play it now and then wait to make it. Are you gear. fucking kidding me? We had to get here when there's a goddamn sandstorm going on, bunch of fucking sand in my eyes. No, you're you got a helmet on. No, I don't. I don't. Dude's a little fucking whiner, isn't he? It is so fucking dangerous out here with this fucking weather. You never know what kind of shit's gonna fly into your face with the wind and the sand, but but we should be able to make it to Dregtown if we just, you know, trudge through it. Sign up here. Wait, what's that sign? Sandworms. Oh shit, that's right. Okay, yeah, we we, we got to be really careful. Oh shit, greebles. Look look at them go. They eat up broken ship parts. Does it taste good? I no idea. I'm not I'm not about to give it a taste test. 
Ugh, I'm getting sand in my mouth. You fucking helmet wearing piece of shit. You you can't relate to this. Why don't I have a helmet? You're getting me the helmet upgrade the second we're done with this shit. Ah, I've got to refresh those controls. Wait. Dodge. The grub shot. Blood kidney disc shot. Oh, I can't even remember this. We've got Kenny and Knifey. There's Knifey. Nine tools, wonderful. Cuss. Don't know what warp discs do. <laughs> That's so weird that it's presented as a form. There's a fucking hu my favourite martial art is a fucking huge gun. <laughs> Screw this stupid throne. Screw it. Let's hand down and come back on the battlefield. God, I fucking hate the forums. I mean, worse than forums is Discord, really, for like going and getting support. Although, the other night I went and got some support on this like little emulator I'm building. And that was on Discord. It was fairly quick, I was surprised. Tap, jump. Hold his jetpack, dodge, slide, bash, reload, next weapon, weapon wheel, info scanner, crouch, in midair you can hover, previous weapon, next weapon. Right, aim down sights, interact, primary fire, weapon ability. What's the plan? What's up? doing it's you and me bounty hunter have i got some like lb hey 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 don't get lost out here i feel like it's gonna be pretty easy to get lost if, if your ass don't pay attention pay attention Did I do myself like a control thing? Sometimes I do that when I know I'm not going to come back to a title. But other times, when I think I'm definitely coming back to this in no time soon. Uh oh, uh oh, I see something! I see something! Oh, nope! It's still all just desert. Yeah, shit, man. There, there is a way to like what. What is the way to do it? I have Kenny in my hand. Not Kenny, Knifey. So, 
There is something up there. Nice or not nice. Perfect, but not perfect. We go right here, right in the... But Sandstorm? Look at that. I'm not no Sandstorm chaser. Let's look for Dragtown and just find some shelter. Not that Dragtown is safer than this dump. It's actually less safe, but it's probably where we're going to find Douglas. Holy shit, that's a big worm. Shit. Hey, uh, don't forget to use my glob shot, you know? can kill these guys nobody cares they're just like you know guys to shoot This is, this is the thing. LB. Damn, this crash ship, I'm telling you. Full of ghosts. Yeah, the G3 don't officially run things out here, but, well, unofficially. Yeah, they, 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 they run things out here. Oh, I think that's Old Town in the distance. You know, that was the first settlement out here, pre-G3. We gotta pass through there to get to Douglas. Well, that pack. So I can't get to that thing. What's that? Yeah, a wreck like this is pretty normal on Port Turin. You know, this asteroid's always been a lawless land, but now that the G3 set up shop, it's even worse. Is that nice thing that I'm using for that purpose, I wonder? Alright, let's see! Trash bag babies online monitor. What is it? This is such a strange title. This is so for Rick and Morty fans. Like. Oh. Whoa, whoa, careful! 
careful! Hey, hold on! You know, maybe we can use that to our advantage. I'm afraid I killed it. Now I want to get back into that thing. Can't get all that one. We're just rifling around in your guts real quick. Hee <laughs> hee Yeah. So, if my theory is correct. Oh, damn it. Oh, wait. It's not too late. Get ready for supper, dear. I'll, I'll prepare the meal. <laughs> Fair enough. What's the good stuff? I don't know where Old Town is. I mean, you walk, I'll talk, and shoot. Of the desert, can we just move on to the next bit? You know, please. I know what the after like is nailed them. I'm afraid. I, I am afraid. You know, like I said, it's it's fine that you killed them. You know, no, no nobody's gonna be mad. No one's gonna be missing them. Oh, this thing here. Yeah. Hey, you know, I, I... <laughs> almost whispered in. So cool. So weird. I 
wonder if this is on the cloud. I can see Old Town. It's just across this bridge. Oh, I can't believe this. What? 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 What do we? What do we got? Hey, don't! Don't fucking shut up! Oh, well, great. You killed all the weird construction guys. You know we're free to move along now, like we were Whoa. before we killed them. Hey, sorry, us mac and cheese brothers. You know we can be a little hot-headed. You know it's fine if you kill any of them. You know we're all really loud and annoying, so I get it. You know our family has a lot of brothers, so yeah, it, you know it's no real big loss. It's fine. <laughs> I, uh, oh, okay. See you later then. Oh, jeez. Oh. All right. Bye. Ah, you're back. Oof, you just shifted into the gray zone or the dark, whatever, the evil zone. Uh, what's that thing? Uh, it's wrong. I ain't got no warp discs. without your help by the way you know just in case you were wondering you know it's obvious Right, finally! For the hot second! Hey, what? Why can't I jump up now? Yeah, 
Joe's got him open for ya. <laughs> She's nice. You're a legend. You're a fine legend. Jump across here then. There you go, I've got him open for you. That's a good time to call Kimmy. Okay, yeah, I I I I'm the, I'm the, I'm the, I can help with this. Oh my god. Oh. Burst that up. Come on, you just gotta bounce it off the wall. Hey, nice work. You know, it, it wasn't a hard thing, but n nice work. Just kidding. Time for knifey. Where did all this shit come from? Holy shit. Just for that. Across there, is it? Let's do it is. Oh, shit. Back in action. All right, Old Town. We just move through this place and we'll, we'll get to Douglas. Hey, you whippersnappers looking again to Old Town? Hey, we should talk to this guy. I calls him like I sees him. He, he seems helpful. Howdy there, partner. Welcome to Old Town. They call me Old Wet Grundy. How can I help you? So, uh, why do they call you Old Wet Grundy? It's because I'm old. And I piss myself every day. <laughs> I'm doing it right now. You're, you're pissing yourself while you're talking to us? Oh, yeah. Big time. It's still going. Ooh, this is a good one. Hey, do you happen to know where we can find a, 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 a guy named Douglas? Douglas? The, 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 the G3 fella? <laughs> oh, we. He's a rough one. Never seen somebody drink as much as him. Why, just last night... Nope, I, I shouldn't speak out of turn. The G3 don't like that none, and I don't like them. Just head down to Dragtown. I'm sure you'll find them. And how do we get to Dragtown? It's, it's, it's been a little bit for me. Oh, that's easy. You just go through this gate, pop into Old Town, and shoot straight down the main strip. You can't miss the big Dragtown entrance. It's a real goddamn eyesore. Wish they'd get rid of it. I'll open the gate for you. 
Oh, well, thanks, Grundy. That's all wet, Grundy. And of course, opening the gates my whole job. It's why I'm... What's a castle? I'm happy to do it for some time and no women's never like you. That's a big one, isn't it? like a power cable. Oh, there's more of them? Shoot the hook bug. That's probably somebody's pet. Okay. Yeah, you know what? Let's not waste our time with those assholes. Well, that is trippy. Fuck. Hey, good thinking. We should run as fast as possible at all times and not look at anything around us at all. That shield is powered by the cable, which goes down the boxes and round over here. Fair enough. But what do we do? Has it been going? It hasn't. I can't open that box. Inside. I don't know if I've got the skill. You know, when I was playing Superland, it was like, yeah. I, yeah can, you can just tell if you have or haven't got the skills required to do something. Find this. I suppose if you can't do it, you haven't got the skills or the. What I mean is like the unlocked ability. It's just, it's just skill. Then a bit of persistence, maybe I can get it done, but... Come on, man, is that really necessary? Well, what are you on about? Alright! 
have a good time in there, Yogi. Hey, look at that weirdo in his... Consider that an early retirement. Keep moving, Taurus. I'm losing blood. How'd you kill nine to us? Grow up and leave us alone. Oh, knife is good, isn't he? Oh shit, more G3 causing trouble. Ah, we just want a little chorus. Come on down and take that out. Yeah, we're allowed to harass people. Time to take out the trash. Ooh, I, I got too confident. I don't know, I'm not sure about that. I'm sorry. The G3 is going to have to step up their recruitment. Speaking hypothetically, I'm willing to bet that's not the last of them. Thank you so much for saving me. Oh my God, thank you. Uh, but you know what? I kind of, I'm kind of thinking I would have fucked them. So now I, I don't know. I'm going to go think about that. See <laughs> you later. I'd like a vision of Zoidberg then. I'll get my sci-fi cartoons confused. Oh, that is a fucking horrible entrance. I'll look around a bit more. Let's use my glob shot! some help. See you later. Oh. Well, there's a difference with being killed. This is just falling off. Hey! Wait. Where the fuck are we? down the clown man. Run, I'm back Pop up sides Get the side I don't care I just want to stab it Drunk recruits. You learned anything from Douglas? I'll get it this time. <laughs> yeah. And who the fuck yeah. are you? Oh, you think you're real? 
Another wave? Are you kidding me? Also, there's a deal. Glob shot, you know? down a little bit you know Th oh. thanks to us you know well, well, what a team we are anyways uh l l l l let's uh let's poke our way into dreg town now let's go to dreg town these are on netflix what the fuck this is weird hey there fella you're not from around here are you <laughs> i guess that sounds like kind of a cliche thing to say doesn't it but no i'm genuinely asking Careful, I'm contagious. My name's Cake Mittens. Well, not really. Everyone calls me Cake Mittens because one time I got real drunk and stuck my hands into a big cat. Oh, hide it in plain sight, they said. Hide it in plain sight. Well, now there goes my treasure. Dang it! <laughs> That's weird. Right, this one up there. Me. You knew the hotel? Oh, don't look me in the eye after taking my treasure. Unless you want to give me a tip. Hey, welcome to the old tent. Hey, Fat Finger Floaty's my name. And Trungle Funk's my game. Oh, yeah, no, I, we, we, we don't know what the fuck Trungle Funk is. Oh, you look confused. But I can tell you want to hear my sweet flute tunes. Am I right or am I right? Park your rears and clean your ears. It's Trungle Funk p Flute Time. Okay, you know what? I, I'll admit it. This is good. This is good. Pretty decent. My species is really alcohol resistant, so I just buy so much more alcohol just to get even the slightest buzz. Sometimes I'm. <laughs> My species. Oh, flute night! <laughs> You're gonna have a good time. You wanna avoid the ant folk. Not too kind. Oh boy, we got a touchy feely. <laughs> I never said that. Like, if somebody like you know, rubs past you in a bar. Or... Oh shit, man! I don't know how to get up there. That—that that is what I want. Well, 
What the fuck? I noticed all that before. I can't believe the level of detail in this game. One thing that surprises me is it, it I don't think it's a co-op. No. It's a damn shame that. Damn shame. So what do you think the G3 even stands for? You you'd think we'd know that, right? You'd think the main bad guys, we should know what their fucking name stands for, huh? You know? Maybe we'll find out later, you know, some deep lore shit. Maybe it's on a fucking forum post or something. I bet it's not that interesting. I bet it's like, um, ooh, my, my tummy grumbled three times. I know, let's call it the G3 or, you know what I mean? Ooh. What shit? That there. My name's Mrs. Calmers. I grew up here in Old Town. Didn't used to be called Old Town, though. I remember when we were just town. They changed the name when they built a newer, better town on the bottom of the asteroid. Now that's New Town. We're not New Town. I wish we were New Town. Okay. Anything else to say? They call me Mrs. Calmers because I... Get. How do I get up onto that thing there? Rip off. I know. That was just not worth it. Shit. Hmm. An AC unit. Oh, no. Time to get a move on. Oh, don't want to go in there. in the entrance then. Damn, you called me up just when I was in the middle of a nice dream. Merc 
Orcs only. No bounty hunters allowed. What? Is that the DLC? Well, anyway, you said it's just thank down the main street. Thank you so much for saving me. Oh my God, thank you. Uh, but you know what? I kind of, I'm kind of thinking I would have fucked him. So now I, I don't know. I'm going to go think about that. See you later. the entrance. It really makes me just want to watch Rick and Morty now. But I've seen them all, I think. I think I've seen all the latest. Are you going to join the G3? You look tough. I bet they'd love to have someone like you. Hey, have, have fun in Dragtown. Be careful. A lot of G3 guys down there, and they're a bit trigger-happy. Ooh, trigger -happy. you heading down to Dragtown? It's way cooler than Old Town. I, Old Town's a boring... Well, ain't you in a rush by? The G3 really spruced up Dragtown. You can get anything you want down there. Drugs? Sure. Sex? Yep. Those are the only two things I can think of. Oh, wait. Laptops. You can get laptops, I bet. Drugs, <laughs> sex, and laptops? That's dra- Oh, you know I was talking, right? Hold on. That's so weird. Hold on. A scruffy state, isn't it? Are you looking for glory? Then join the G3 cartel! My name's Douglas, the G3 Chief of Training and Torture. Ignore that second bit for this ad. This was just about the training. Well, goddamn, that, there, there's Douglas right there. Uh, that's how you know we're in the right spot. such a detailed world it's a shame i feel like i'm i'm sort of briskly no, trying to no get through it allowed here. Take mothers care. against violence Oof, well that, that falls in our favor huh we don't, we're not gonna have to worry about any trouble in this area moms here in dragtown got together at the last mama palooza and decided it would be fun to have a few small sectors where we don't all kill each other all the time it's amazing the way the gun interacts with the tv as well violence. Stop. Oh, hello. Now buy something. It sounds like the voice of, uh... Come on, I got good shit. Buy something. Marvel of the Galaxy. You know, Guardians of the Galaxy. The, the rodent thing. 
I shoot everyone that doesn't buy stuff from me. Well, now knife you to stagger enemies more often. You know, everyone who walks away without buying something, I put them on a list and then I send assassins to kill them. I'm having a look, motherfucker. You know, I killed every person who didn't buy something from me. Perfect. Need anything else? No, that's all you got. If I was you, I wouldn't stick around. I got a system here. I sell stuff, you buy it. Well, we've got kiosks. Wow, so this is what a G3 run city looks like. Anyway, yeah, I'm excited to join the G3, but I'm gonna miss my wife and six kids. Oh yeah, I had mine killed before I left so I wouldn't feel bad. Wow, that's so smart. I'll do that too. I'm gonna kill my wife and kids so I don't miss them. I love the interactivity. I love the way that video comes up and any comments on the video. There's a lesson for a lot of devs and publishers in this game. A hell of a lesson. There's so many aspects of it. It's really well optimised. The graphics are superb. Humor's mediocre, but it takes a lot to make me laugh, really. So that like I was saying, my brother told me Douglas is really into torture. I'm sexually. Does it matter? Yes, to me it needs to be sexual. Why are you telling me this? Uh -huh. I barely know you. Oh, my bad. Yeah, just sort of spilled out. Well, now you know. Do with it what you will. It doesn't take a lot to make me laugh. He's just, he's not like a, a level of sophistication that's required. It's just certain things I find funny and some things I don't, I suppose. What the fuck are all these? What's on the end there? Why they're all blurred out? <laughs> That's so weird. Everywhere. I hate the G3 like everyone else, sure. But hey, if the G3 wasn't here, who the hell would be buying my sounding rods? Sounding rods? Yeah, it's a little metal rod you stick up your urethra, if you got one. It's the family oh, business. Fuck. We sell little metal sticks you shove up dick holes. You think you're better than me? Well, you are. You 100% are better than me. I'm dirt. And the G3 wants to buy all my sounding rods. So fuck off. Uh, okay, uh, all right then. So weird. Oh god, people do do shit like that in real life. Oh god, it's so grim. So grim. But then again, I find piercing your face with metal fucking grim. Let alone sticking something up your Reese. Oh. Watch my nipples, they're sensitive! The fuck. Flashback babies. Sorry. This one was supposed to be something funny like annoying Alec and he's talking about his least favourite anime dubs or something dull like that. We do die before we drew him, so now he's just dead Alec. Oh, I hope we don't have to meet Douglas. Yeah, jeez, that guy scares the shit out of me. He was trying to play Gary alive at the party last night. He should have. Honestly, Gary's a racist. Oh yeah, Gary needs to be flayed alive for sure. Just, you know, there's a time and a place. Maybe we shouldn't <laughs> be talking about this stuff out loud. I could say weird sense of humor. Excuse me. Eyes open, bozo. You guys at the party last night? I can't believe Nipulon showed up. Oh, I saw. Nipulon is so cool. He was looking real good. Easily the hottest G3 officer. Whoa, whoa, whoa. Nipulon's not as hot as Sector Giblets. What? Nipulon's way hotter, trust me. And he's got charisma. That goes a long way. <laughs> is it, I, like, I like the way they're just almost, you know, the bad guys, but they've just got this, like, corporateness about them that's just... You know, this insipid corporateness about them. Oh, that could be fun. Like 
They must like they oh. must run through these guys like I run through a sleeve of Oreos. <laughs> oh yeah, I, I've killed a few myself. What's no good, Gorzos? Coming here, you know, taking our jobs, eating <laughs> our Oreos, eating our Oreos. Hey, why do you, you know keep mean? mentioning Oreos? Are, are they paying you or something? I have no idea what you're talking about, man. I am in no way affiliated with Nabisco or their parent company, Mondelez International. <laughs> okay, now. Oh, they convinced me. Let's join the G3. Actually, that wouldn't be a bad idea if we're going to infiltrate. Also, all our children are in their 30s at least, so this isn't about them. We don't really if you touch me again, die, I'll eat your head. Hate violence. Have fun out there, kids. I'm Senator all Thomas Michael Phillips, right? Douglas and I support mothers up. against Oh yeah, violence. that guy was pounding the back like a full-grown Damn, can you believe they built all this on the bottom of an asteroid? I, I mean, I, I, I'm not going to lie, it's, it's a good place to hide out, I mean, but yeah. Fuck. Fucking size of this place. sweet little organization called Mothers for Violence. And you're <laughs> about to enter a sector under our jurisdiction. That's right. There's Mothers Against Violence. What's going down? Fucking dealing with some greebles over there, dumb fucks. Let's just kill them all. Fuck! We're gonna take care of you, lickety split. How much you want when you're dead? Let's do it. What are the rest of them?
bounty hunter. Shit, they just keep coming. Joy now. Come on out so I can shoot you. Ready to go. Call me dead. Call me dead. I welcome being killed. Wow, those mothers weren't kidding around. That that was violent. Where am I going? Or where have I come from? I think I came from that way. And I picked up. Huh. So this is where they train G3 recruits. I bet we're getting closer to Douglas. Okay, Douglas again. This ad is about to torture. Oh. Last one was Wanna about to sneak in? G3, but this one is about oh, I love. Fuck yeah. G3. Random strangers who look to be funny. Anybody. I'll torture whoever. Doesn't matter to me. Back to the grind. G3 recruits only. No yellow goop armor. No entry. Beat it. God damn it. Okay, we're going to need to find some way to get in. Uh, we can't tell you where we're located because we, we can't put that on TV. That's going to be a problem for us. Grow up and we're leave us alone. We're going to make you grow. It's really cool. We're going to put a, we're going to craft a gun onto your arm and you can just shoot it whenever you want. Then you get to wear our cool yellow goop armor. If you're someone who might get hurt easy, say no more to that. You're gonna be covered in sticky yellow goop. That's very heavy. That's cool. That kicks ass. I got shot a bunch, but I was wearing that goop armor, and I only have a couple of fractures in my bones, and I did need to get surgery to remove shrapnel. Come on down to Douglas's training center. Get. Do you wanna? Do you wanna fuck? Douglas's training center. Let's 
do it. Whatever it is. Hey, hey, you can trust me. He's fine. I'm trustworthy. I promise. Hey, hey there. Thanks for coming over here. I'm the goop guy around these parts. You wanna sneak in the G3 facilities? You gotta get covered in goop. That's just how it goes. My stuff's quality. So you, you want some goop, right? Uh, yeah. you know what? Yes. How about how about a big fat yes? Let's go. Perfect. Head down the alley there and just uh let the magic happen. I guess. Uh, don't don't worry. First goop's on me. Just tell all your buddies about it. I'm the goop guy. I do goop stuff. Oh! Oh! This fucking so! Oh my god! The smell! Oh my god! I'm gonna fucking throw up. Okay. Okay. I'm all right. Okay. Oh my god! Th this better fucking work. Hey! Look at you. You're all gooped up. I gotta be honest. It won't last long. It's not the real stuff. So you better be quick. Get in. Get out. Don't stay in there too long. Don't lollygag. Cause this stuff's gonna fall off. That's the goop guy. Oh, looky here. We got another gooped up G3 recruit. Be advised that the G3 cartel is not responsible for any life-threatening injuries you may incur on these premises. But even if we were, we wouldn't give a shit. Who cares? I hope you get Are you fucking kidding me? They have some whole thing prepared? Shut the fuck up, it's starting. Welcome, welcome, welcome. <laughs> I'm sure you already know who I am, but for anyone living under a rock, I'm Douglas, G3 Chief of Training and Torture. And wouldn't you know it, I like to blur those lines a little. Training, torture, what's the difference, I say? I look to your left, now look to your right. Both of those people are gonna die today. You are about to jump right into an accurate work-based simulation of what it'll look like to be on the real battlefield. And let me tell you, you're probably gonna die. But hey, if you don't, you get to join the G3, big whoop. All right, that's it, lock and load, fuckers. Oh my God, is that, right, shut you saw up. that, right? I got torture in the Gatlian. Do. Douglas has a Gatlian. We, we, we got a rescuer. Jesus, these fucking Merkeloids. Well, fuck, here we go. I, I, we shit, go. I hope it's not too difficult. Where are you? Fucking little freaks. Friendly fire! Oh, the fuckers shooting me as well. Offside! Are you fucking kidding me? More? to launch some discs out of. G3 blood, some of my favorite, you know? That was nothing. Good work, buddy. I guess we're all done. Oh, okay. You beat all the weak guys. Easy. Really easy. Now go do the obstacle course. Oh, okay. Okay, you know what? It looks like some simple platforming, you know, like what you'd see in like Lucky's Tale on, uh, you know, or um, you know that one uh, that one game Lucky's that Tale. we that we all know and love, Mario Land or whatever. Oh God, I'm slipping! I'm slipping! I'm slipping! I'm slipping! I'm slipping! Ah! You know, uh, listen. Uh, you're not gonna impress me if you if you if you get through this. Cause it's pretty simple. Oh God, uh, I have a pacemaker. One zap would kill me. How are things going? All right, I see what's popping here. It's easy to get into the G3. No, did you just get hurt? Don't embarrass me now. Oh shit!
All right, I see what's popping here. It's easy to get into the G3. Let's wrap this up, huh? Here we go. Damn thing. Look, if I had some legs, I could do this better than you. Hey, I am not with this bounty hunter. I do not know them. I do not. Damn, good jump. That last bit was tougher than I thought it would be. Congratulations, shitheads. So you made it past the first training exercise. Big deal. That one was easy. We lied and said it was hard to scare you. Oh, it's fun to freak you out, to fuck with your heads. Now get ready for exercise two. It starts in one hour. That's right, you have to wait a full hour. We're testing your resolve. So just stand there patiently and wait. Then this door will open and you can continue. Uh, okay, there's no way we're waiting a full hour. Seriously, for fuck's sake, don't make us wait a whole hour. Go put the kettle on. I'm gonna go put the kettle Bounty on. Hunter, please, for fuck's sake, I'm begging you, just find another way out of here. All right. Okay, thank God. Okay, let, let's ditch this whole recruiting bullshit thing. Oh shit, okay, well, there goes that bootleg goop. Uh, I guess that didn't last for very long. Let's oh not kill God. them, okay? Oh, thank God you're here. My name's Dr. Jupy. Douglas kidnapped my whole family, and I'm trying to sneak in and save them. But I just can't get through these pipes in the next room. Oh my God, I'm freaking out. Hey, whoa, whoa, l l listen, little guy. We're trying to find Douglas, too. You know, maybe we can help each other. God, I'm so worried I'm gonna, gonna throw up. You really helped me? Oh, gee, I'm, I'm so grateful. Follow me. You gotta connect these pipes for me so I can get through and save my family. Hey, don't worry. This is a classic textbook puzzle situation. I think me and my bounty hunter partner can figure this one out. Don't even worry. Oh, how wondrous. I'm forever in your debt. I don't know how I can ever repay you. God, my poor family. <laughs> You did it! You got the door open! Listen, I'll never forget this. You're my personal hero. Oh, come on! You're too you're too kind. It, it was easy. Oh, did you say you're heading to find Douglas too? His office is that big building up on top of Dreadtown. Uh, there's a zip line just past here that'll take you right to him. Huh. Well, all right then. I I, I hope the guy gets his family back. I'll not just take a car then. Wow. Looks busy. Ow! All right, Douglas, here we come. That was the hardest part behind us. This is basically done. We finished this shit. We are fully finished, basically, as far as... Oh, fuck! <sighs> okay. What is this? Congratulations to all of you worms who made it this far in your training. 
It is now time for the final test, a bloody free-for-all. Last one standing gets to join the G3. No rules, just killing. Good luck, shitty. God damn it, another fucking thing with this. Holy shit, just kill them all. Here's Summon's a dictionary. You and me make the perfect team. Yeah, good job. Congratulations, recruit. Now, uh, I don't know, fight some more guys. week, you know? Script. Well, what's the wait, happening? Wait, wait. somebody's pet. Oh, I'm going higgly-piggly mode. Oh, you, 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 you left me alive. Shit, shit, shit. Eat my bullets, Marie Antoinette. Barely even count. Do 
Congratulations, graduates on joining the G3 or whatever. I really can't stress enough how little I give a shit. Now report to your commanding officer and we'll send you off to die fighting for us on whatever dumbass planet we decide. See ya. Oh, Chris. Where the fuck are crystals? I don't see no crystals. know what's up. No pressure, no pressure. Don't buy anything. Please don't buy anything. No damage. You know we don't do returns, right? It's a deal. Well, not a good deal. <laughs> I gotta come clean. I'm great at the sales pitch, but really, this shop is not all that impressive. We don't do refunds, sorry.
Oh, you can bash into the bad guys. Don't worry, you'll probably find what you're looking for somewhere else. There's a guy that's meditating there. Oh, it's you! Oh, you again! Am I glad to see you? I'm so happy we keep running into each other! Sounds oh, like look who it's our old buddy! It's our old friend, Dr. Jupy! What are you talking about? How wh How's it going? Uh, there's another locked door! I'm running out of time. God, I'm so worried about my kids. And a little bit about my wife, but mostly my kids. Okay, well, we'll, we'll see what we can do. Oh, my poor kids. I hope Douglas doesn't kill them. I can feel my wife, Plenty, calling for me. You're going to solve this one, too. Thank you. I don't want to rush you, but I'm getting nervous. Swoopy and Froopy would really like you to. Oh, they're good kids. I can't wait to introduce them to you and tell them about everything you did for me. They need good, strong role models. Oh, Plimmy and the kids are probably so scared without me. I hope Douglas isn't torturing them right now. How can I repay you? Uh, should I tip you? Uh, how much do you tip for helping solve a puzzle? <laughs> amazing! Amazing! You did it again! Douglas's office isn't too far from here. I'm going on ahead. I'll see you there. Jesus Christ, Douglas is gonna kill Dr. Jupy. Look at look how weak and, and cute Dr. Jupy is. Mm -hmm. Forget about it. Uh, uh. Whoops! What the fuck? How am I supposed to? Announcement. This sector has temporarily been designated as a mother's for and against violent zone. That means there's probably just going to be a lot of violence. An intruder has infiltrated the G3 recruitment program, and there will be lots of violence here until we find and kill them. And remember... Huh, I guess they're talking about us. Remember, I'm still here, and I support any and all mothers out there. I'll believe whatever cause they ask me to believe in. Hot mother, not hot mother. You know what? That looks like Douglas's office, but we can't get in that way. Maybe we can go around back. Oh man, what time is it?
Exercise it. Oh, shit. Here we go. Come on. Shoot me. Uh, nobody's gonna miss you. These fuckers are there. Uh. Somebody, what are my plants? Bounty Hunter, you still here? But I just paid off my student loans. Oh. your step all right that should cover us for a while Shoot the hook bug. That's probably somebody's pet. for the thought of getting burned. I know where you're hiding. I just 
don't care. They'll mend the souls of these broken men. My doctor is in. You don't mess with the glob. Where's that come from? You know what? That's what they get for joining the G3. You know, I, I, I guess. I don't. I don't know. It's. I, I, I'm. I, I'm. I'm conflicted on it. It's rough. Oh, I thought there was a thing here. Wait, am I supposed to be going that way? Yeah! Oh, yo! What up, Dr. J? Every time you go away, I miss you more and more, man. Look at Dr. Jupy. What's up, Dr. Jupy? Oh, my best friends. This is it. Douglas is right beyond this door. Can you help me out one last time? Sure thing, buddy. Oh, huzzah! Plimmy, Froopy, Sloopy, here I come! Oh, oh shit. There's the input point. You're so good at these. I wish I was as good at these as you. You're really good. Did you go to puzzle school? You can do it! Oh, I can't wait to see my little flimmy, proppy, and droopy! I'm really, really trying not to think about my wife's body being ripped in half by one of Douglas's torture devices, and it's not working, to be honest! decided that if my family is dead, I'm going to kill myself and join them in the afterlife. Don't talk me out of it. This is what love does to a person. Don't feel bad if it takes you a while. It's tough, right? I know that earlier I said, don't feel bad if this person... You're a good team.
Well, shit! D does that mean he's... Huh? I... <laughs> oh, fuck off! <laughs> I was never Dr. Jupy. There is no Dr. Jupy. Are you shocked, you idiot? You complete fucking moron! Oh, of course you are. <laughs> Douglas motherfucker. <laughs> and to think you never once suspected your helpless little friend, Dr. Jupy, was actually hiding his true identity. Ha! It's naive people like you that get killed by smart geniuses like me! You know what? Who gives a shit? This is perfect. We're, we're here to kill you either way. Fucking die, bitch! Wait, what? Ha, you morons still have it backwards. I'll be the one killing you! I am... There never was any Flimmy or Gaffy or whatever those made-up, stupid, rotten little kids were called. In fact, those aren't even real names! Nobody would have those names! When did you ever run into somebody named Flimmy? Let's see how you deal with my trained recruits, who are also my torture victims! I'm rubber in your glue, and I'm a gun! Killing these weak fucks doesn't do anything for me! You should have stayed Dr. Jupy! We loved him! You, sh you should have quit being Douglas and lived the rest of your life as that guy! One giant leap for Douglas! One giant leap for me! Again for all the hell. I got wasted at the party and woke up in a ditch without my exosuit. I was helpless and vulnerable. And wide open for stabbing. Catch me if you can. I can't believe you Hans Grubert us, you sick fuck. We trusted Dr. Jupy. Let's not jump to conclusions! You gotta try this Gatorall sometime. It, it, it might kill you, though. That's the only thing. Torture victim! Attack the bounty hunter! You're lucky. I'm still a little hungover. I'll give you dead by now! Careful, he can shoot through walls with that charge shot. Shit. I did not know that. <laughs> and to think you never once suspected your helpless little friend was that from the box. You deal with my trained recruits, who are also my torture victims! It's ha! There never was any Flimmy or Jeffy or whatever those made-up, stupid, rotten little kids were called. In fact, those aren't even real names! Nobody would have those names! When did you... Dr. Jupy, we loved him. You, sh you should have quit being Douglas and live the rest of your life as that guy. Careful, he can shoot through walls with that charge shot. Hold still. Ah, they're still squirming. You're dead. Thanks again for all the help. 
I got wasted at the party and woke up in a ditch without my exosuit. I was helpless and vulnerable. You could have killed me so easy when I wasn't wearing my suit. But instead, you helped me back into it. <laughs> Idiots! Don't you get me messing with me. I won't let you out. I won't look at me. Maybe you need a jump start. I can't believe you Hans Krubert us, you sick fuck. We trusted Dr. Jupy. Hans Krubert. Die hard. Damn you, Douglas. <laughs> and to think you never once suspected your helpless little friend, Dr. Jupy, was actually hiding his true identity. Ha! It's naive people like you that get killed by smart geniuses like me! You know what? Who gives a shit? This is perfect. We're, we're, we're here to kill you either way. Fucking die, bitch! Wait, what? <laughs> Let's see how you deal with my trained recruits, who are also my torture victims! Yeah. Ha! There never was any Flimmy or Jeffy or whatever those made-up stupid rotten little kids were called. In fact, those aren't even real names! Nobody would have those names! When did you ever run into somebody named Flimmy? I am jumping! You should have stayed Dr. Jupy. We loved him. You, sh you should have quit being Douglas and lived the rest of your life as that guy. You got lucky. Oh, oh. Good. You know I had a pretty good feeling you were fucking with us. Don't think you pulled one over on me because you definitely didn't. Or you won't survive this. You're lucky I'm still a little hungover. Else you'd be dead by now! Teenage fuckers! Oh, maybe it's free at first, man! Did I miss anything? Checkpoints. <laughs> and to think you never once suspected your helpless little friend, Dr. Jupy, was actually hiding his true identity. Ha! It's naive people like you that get killed by smart geniuses like me. Let's see how you deal with my trained recruits who are also my torture victims. Don't you get me? Let's shut that apple good. 
Don't forget, I can shoot this. Ha! There never was any Flimmy or Jeffy or whatever those made up, stupid, rotten little kids were called. In fact, those aren't even real names. Nobody would have those names. When did you ever run into somebody named Flimmy? Ah! Torture big dog! Attack the bounty hunter! Maybe you need a jump start! I gotta admit, it was getting boring in there. It's pretty fucked up that you tricked us like that. Also, you work for the G3, you know, both are fucked up. the stuff. Oh, now that felt good. He had some very nice choppable flesh, actually. It was actually very nice. <laughs> Calamari, I think. Coming up. All right, dipshit, let's go. What? No hello? Nice to meet you, or thank you for saving me? Why? Like you not dying there with some sort of favor to me? Hi, I'm Queasy. Thanks so much for rescuing me. How is that, like dipshit? Needler. Now come on, use my time bubble to escape through the big fan in the corner. It does look like a uh, needler out of Halo. Hey, if you want to slow down time, it's ready. Pretty cool, right? You're gonna find out real fast that I'm the best Gatlian. Smartest, most useful, best looking. No, no, come on, come on, I'm pretty good. Douglas, it's Garmentuous. Where the fuck are you? I heard you made a complete fool of yourself at that party last night. Not good, Douglas. Not good. I'm gonna need you on top of your game now that we've got a hold of these humans. We're spread thin over on Earth. And I need more troops immediately. Not to mention things are going to start heating up all over the galaxy as demand goes up. Big things are happening, Douglas. Get excited and get your fucking shit together. <laughs> okay, yeah, fuck that. Oh, God, I hope nobody comes up and shoots us. You know, I hope nobody got a brand new cool talking gun that you they want to use and guys use, up? Uh, uses it on us. I hope that doesn't... Nice shot, bounty hunter! Blast these idiots! Hey, you wanna know my real hat trick? My crystals stick into baddies and they'll explode if we hit them real hard. Like with your knife. You get it. Go nuts! Damn it, we have some fun! Team! Oh, done already? I was just getting into it! Mistake, asshole. Aim me at those fuckers and I'll charge up a super crystal. Come on, aim and shoot. What are you, scared? Uh, whoa, what the fuck? We're on the same team. Hey, do you not know how to use me or something? Jesus. No. Let's get that charged.
It's not hard. Just follow the instructions. You can use that to detonate my smaller crystals. So just blast some normal shots, then finish them off with my super crystal. You got that, dipshit? You're a stomach. Come on, aim and shoot. What are you, scared? Do you not know how to use me or something? Oh, the coward wants to hide, huh? Well, it's not gonna work! Check this out. Aim me at that candy ass and shoot him through his cover. Fuck yeah! He had no idea what hit him. Oh, now we gotta get across, huh? Hey, you wanna see what else this time bubble can do? I think I've got an idea. Oh, jeez, do I gotta spell it out for ya? Try slowing down one of the ships, then we can use it to hop a great, perfect. Now hurry and cross before it wears off. Damn, motherfucker. Whoa, great! Now we're falling to our death! Quick, cross fast. The time bubble doesn't last forever, you know. Incredible, right? What a thrill. You know, you can use that time bubble on the G3, too. And try loading the bubble up with my crystal. Then you can see why I'm the best Gatlian. <sighs> We're gonna make a good team. I can feel it. Just listen to everything I say and never use the other Gatlians. What's next? You turned into bounty somewhere? Go do that. We can wrap this up. Hey, kid. Another one down, huh? Great work. <laughs> but, uh, hey, there's something you should see. Take a look after you turn in your bounty. Here is one of them testicular standoffs. You must squeeze as much, Michael. What the fuck? I'm gonna count to three, and then you both. Man, turn in that bounty already. I gotta show you this. Two, two, three, three. Damn it, I can't. All right, good. Get over here. Check this out. That's Clug Nugman. Blim City Magistrate. As you all know, I'm working hard to flush out all the crime and drugs from our streets. I'll be the first to admit, we haven't made much headway in the fight against the G3 cartel. Right, right. Now catch this next bit. All about to change. We've learned of a bold bounty hunter who's been bravely taking this G3 matter into their own hands. You hear that? He's talking about you! They've already dealt with two of the cartel's most powerful officers. Yeah, you got lucky. I have too proud to ask for help in our war on drugs. Bounty Hunter, if you're listening, please consider joining forces with the good people of Blim City. I hope you'll choose to come forward and meet with me personally at my office in City Hall. Yeesh, desperate much? Can he even help us? I already told him you go. Oh, great. No, don't start. Trust me, he's legit. This guy's been anti-G3 since before any of you were even in diapers. Honestly, I don't know if... Gatlin's even wear diapers. Head through there. Clug's expecting you. Sorry for making the call without you, but uh, Clug's a good man. I say we hear him out. Yeah, I say I... Mm. Yeah. Thank you so much for coming, Bounty Hunter. No problem. It's, 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 it's nice to meet you, sir. Look, I'll cut to the chase. I need your help. You're a human, correct? My men looked into it. Sorry. You survived the G3's attack on your home planet Earth, right? Well, we're, we, we're, we're Gatlians, but, uh... Of course. Sorry. I'm familiar with your plight as well. It's such a tragedy what happened on Gatlas. It makes much sense that you and the human would join forces. 
But perhaps you have room for one more ally as well? But, but you're a big name politician and we're out there, you know, killing people. Like, wouldn't that look bad? That's precisely why I need your help. I'm having the darndest time curbing the species drug trade. I can only do so much and only within the confines of the law. I mean, I've got my hands full with Gary the Poisoner. He's not just poisoning the water supply, he's moved on to poisoning weirder stuff now, like street lamps. We don't even know how that works or if it's actually a problem. Maybe it's fine to poison street lamps. I'm a bit overwhelmed, and I wish I could focus more time on the G3. But you, you've taken out two top G3 officers in less time than it takes us to file a single report. So you see how you can help me, but there's also one way I can help you. Okay, we're, we're listening. This tool on my desk here will help you rescue your fellow humans. You can use it to teleport them to a safe haven my team has arranged for them to stay at until the G3 are dealt with. Wow, that, that, that's really helpful. You're just giving it to us? Well, the human species is technically a drug. I can't have dangerous sentient drugs in the hands of my citizens, and you can't have your people getting captured and consumed. This solves both of our problems, assuming you plan to continue taking out the G3. We absolutely do. Then, thank you. Sincerely, you humans and Gatlians, you're both very noble species. This means a lot to me. I've made it my life's work to use my power to help people in need, but even I have my limits. I'm just glad I have someone like you to turn to. As a token of thanks, my team will be feeding any intel we find on the G3 directly to your handler, Mr. Zaruthian. We've already sent him everything we had. The rest is in your hands. Thank you so much, Mr. Nugman. That's all I have for you. Feel free to stay as long as you like. The view is breathtaking. Oh, uh, feel free to stay as long as you'd like. You can visit the human haven yourself, by the way. We don't know exactly what makes humans comfortable, but I hope you like how we've set things up. So if I just sliced off one of those things, how? I won't ask to see your face, but... I am curious. I'll bet you're covered in cool battle scars. Detrimental it would be. All right, we're back. So, it went well, huh? I got a message saying they'll hook us up with any G3 intel they find. Yeah, not only that, he gave us a way to save humans. God damn. You got it easy. Nothing as convenient as this ever happened when I was bounty hunting. Hey, uh, speaking of... We should get you a jetpack before you head back out into the field. You're really gonna need it. Head on down to the pawn shop and see if they got one in stock. Oh, and yeah, you might want to hit up Broto's chef stand too. He's a little shady, but uh, those warp discs he's selling can be pretty helpful. Warp discs. Discs. I love you. I genuinely love you. Next time, Tom, look at me. I wanna fuck you. Okay. Okay. You're oh, you look like you're hungry for some food. Wink, wink. I can help. Wink, wink, wink. Hey, welcome to Blordo's. I'm Blordo. You here for the food? Or the other stuff. <laughs> what, what do you mean, other stuff? Nothing, nothing, nothing. Forget I said anything. <laughs> no, come on, we're, we're good. T tell us. Oh, fine. I sell secret shit if you know what to ask for. But don't tell the cops. Now order something or leave. Oh, good choice! You got it! Sure thing! See you later, valued food customer! I'm 
yeah, I'm confused about that. What this business? Um, I can't remember where the shop is. I thought it was up here. Was it up there? Jetpacks in stock? A jetpack? Oh, certainly. I can help. Uh, I can help. Oh, oh, sorry, partner. That's not for sale. I will tell you what I want. Where's this jet pattern? Oh, sorry, partner, that's not for sale. Jetpack, huh? Great choice. Really phenomenal choice. Let's lock that purchase in. Okay, great. So where where's the jetpack? Not so fast. I gotta back order that bad boy. I'll have it ready for you in a couple of days. I promise. Okay, no refunds, no. by the way. This purchase is final. Fuck! God damn it. Okay, well let's let's just give Gene the update. Job, what's wrong with you? Why did your mother do this to you? You can't stop me from being me, Dad. You're grounded. Try me. I'll just listen to poor at Max Ball. Well, that seals the deal. Another great piece of business. Jorb. Now, I know I hate to be pushy, but can you get your grubby hands off that phone and do some inventory before the end of the day? Not interested. Oh, well, you know, I told your mom I'd make sure you took this job seriously. That's nice, Pop. Come on, Jorb. You're embarrassing mm -hmm. me in front of the customer. Oh, yeah? You think that's embarrassing? Hey, you, guess what? My dad over there won an award for having the world's smallest dick in space. Hey, come on now. It's true, too. I'm being 100% serious. He's still got the trophy. He keeps it in the back. Well, I happen to be very proud of my tiny little penis and the award I won. What the oh, fuck? What a buy. I loved watching you buy that. Oh, hurry up. I'm kind of busy in case you didn't notice. Oh. Uh. When's my shift over? I need to go do literally anything. See you soon, I hope. Oh, I don't think there is a way through that way. Wow! Here we go! <laughs> Yo, bounty on us! Come see what I've got in stock on the food menu.
How'd it go? Did you get a jetpack? Yeah, but it's on back order. Great. Perfect excuse for a rest. We're still waiting on Clug's intel anyway. Why don't you go to bed and sleep off some of that excitement? Gene's right. That, that's, that sounds like a good idea. Come on, let's go. Get me out of here. Huh, so your civilization had computers at least. Hey, good night, partner. I'm just gonna sit right here and watch you fall asleep. I'm really glad we met. You know, I, I think I think we're doing something amazing here. How cool would it be if we actually stopped the G3? Sorry, sorry, I, 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 I'm just, I'm excited. I'll shut up, L let's get some sleep. Pretty soon, you know, we'll be jetpacking across all the space. Sorry, I'm, I'm being too loud. You're probably trying to, let's get you to sleep. Partner, let's take this jetpack for a spin. Can you make it over that gap? Holy shit, this rules! Oh, check out that landing! God damn! Oh fuck, dude. You gotta get better at pranks. Alright, and I'll try my best. Click. Okay. Alright, I I'm really losing confidence in my pranking abilities. Let's do another prank though. Let's just hope we get this one right. Damn, you're just like a TonyHawk.com jetpack pro. So do you What ledge? Well, I gotta tell you, Gene was right. That is gonna come in handy. It's also fun. You can fly while doing combat. It's a very cool uh, feature that we have here. We put a lot of time and effort into it. Let's head back and talk to Gene and see if there's any new bounties. I've been telling you to clean up. This place is a mess. I need you to clean it up before Tweet gets here. Oh, got a big date with your sad sack Flimborg boy toy? Fuck off, Gene. Like you've even never been on a date. Hey, don't even start, sister. I know a lot about dates. I fuck more aliens than your brain can comprehend. And even I don't want to touch your boyfriend. So sick of hearing about this guy. Yeah, right. My boyfriend is so fucking hot, though, right? What a weird thing. Oh, come on. You haven't even seen him. Why'd you answer that? Trust me, you don't have to support her just because she's family. This guy's a loser. He is so hot. He's like a low seven or a high six. And he's really nice to me. Yeah, no ulterior motives there. Just clean up after yourself, Jesus. Hey, look, I'm sorry if I'm coming off harsh. He's messing up the group dynamic. We've got a good thing going here. We do that fun sitcom banter back and forth while your nibbling here goes and blasts alien baddies in the face. Ooh. It's great! Dude, you're lucky you even get to live here with us. I don't care about your damn dynamics. I'm just saying you barely know this guy. Are you sure you're even attracted to him? Most aliens only bang their own species. Oh, what about you? You just said you've slept with basically everything in the whole galaxy. Yeah, but I'm a washed-up degenerate. You've got your whole life ahead of you. That's more condescending than it is sweet. What? No, uh, look, we've spent all this time living together. I, I care about you now, Leslie. For fuck's sake, my name's Lizzie. Come on, tell her I care about her. Excuse me? <laughs> no, sorry, but I am not about to let this Fuck up degenerate. School me on life decisions. The fact that I'm a fuck up degenerate is exactly why you should let me school you <laughs> on life decisions. I, I know better than anyone what not to do. You're both assholes. Yeah? Well, you're gonna get this twee guy pregnant. And then I'll be here to tell you I told you so. And who's gonna have to deal with all your mutant kids running around this house? Me! Yeah, not that it matters, but I'm the one who would get pregnant. Not the way his species works. They get pregnant real easy. I'm so sick of this shit. Look, I just don't want Twig to think I'm messy, okay? It's that simple. And I don't want you dating him at all. Why don't I set you up with my nephew, Grimble Dick? He's got a steady job. And yes, before you ask, he's got both his legs. 
That's not like a family ailment or anything. Fuck off. Just grow up and get used to me and Tweeg. Come on, tell Jean I can date whoever I want. Thank you. Not that I needed your approval. Oh, fine, yeah. Team up against the depressed paraplegic. I didn't know you were depressed. I mean, I knew you were depressing. Har, har, har. Just clean up, Jean, okay? Sorry to drag you into all that. Anyway, a nice little arrangement with Klug is paying off. They sent us intel on two new bounties. So, uh, go ahead if you want to get started on those. Gene. Yeah, you know, I appreciate you having my back, but uh, maybe your sister's right. Or not. What do I care? Team Gene, baby! <laughs> Alright, I think it'll be one of those two then, obviously, next time. Okay, take it easy. <laughs>